Behind my EBR, there are 15 D1 Gunninghams who have to run away now because they only have two minutes to find the best hiding spot on this Oyster Bay map before I'm going to search for them. Tess is the ultimate hide and seek with 15,000 gold prize pool, where every single player this time is guaranteed at least 500 gold, working our way up to the first place, 3,500 gold. Those are all the community members who took part of this, and guys, you won't believe some of the positions what they were using and actually getting away with it as well so simply keep watching because for me in my EBR things are not as easy as it may look let me explain now this is what everyone should see and hear in the normal game but after I removed the six and sounds and dragged the interface all the way to zero this is my game right now when something gets spotted or when I spot something I do not hear anything that together with V mode activated I see absolutely nothing so round one is about to start full map is available they can hide wherever they want and this round goes until I find four players after that we're going to remove some areas but more about that in a second and off we go keep in mind I'm not able to see anything or hear anything when something gets spotted and at first I have to be honest I was a bit paranoid uh, from my previous hide and seek which I did a couple years ago where some people were hiding basically next to me during my countdown while I was looking in the sky so I was not able to hear anything as well uh, bushes on this map are very very thick actually and uh, for the first couple of minutes I was simply able to enjoy this beautiful map if it only would play as beautifully as it looks as well right guys and nothing no results whatsoever until our first victim over here with Death Games camo as well. Boy, gosh, you are beautiful, but rules are rules. Goodbye. First elimination, but 500 gold hopefully makes you happier. And little did I know, some players were able to witness this takeout from the front seat. Like Durundux. Are you scared yet? Let's keep going. And once again, after that first initial takeout, couple minutes off, absolutely nothingness. Was not able to see anyone, was not able to meet meet anyone inside the bushes outside the bushes as well until we found the ballsiest hiding position in this round at least uh, let's play a game can you spot the tank on your screen right now who is hiding in t1 gunning camp <laughs> in the middle of tents very brave, very beautiful, but maniac, sorry, you have been eliminated. They were even playing some tricks with me, as you can see, three has been knocked over, but nothing inside the bushes. But we didn't have to wait long for our next victim, Turundux, who had the front row seat, watching me destroy the first player in this game. Turundux, place number 13, 550 gold this time, congratulations anyway. And just 10 seconds later, we had one of the craziest escapes in this round, or craziest escapes I have ever seen. Now would you believe when I say that inside the previous bush where I just was, there was actually D1 Gunningham as well. You don't believe me? Well, let's look at from the D1's angle. And what can you see? D1 Gunningham just couple millimeters away from getting rammed, spotted and destroyed. It was your lucky day. But that was not the only crazy escape in this round. For example, like this. I was checking the bushes, but I didn't see the guy who was right next to me, one meter away from me. But same sadly cannot be said about our next elimination, who is Lugia345. Thank you for participating, 550 gold is yours as well. And just like that, we are done with round number one. It is time to reposition and eliminate some areas from the south, east and west. Nobody is allowed to hide in those areas, we are shrinking the circle down a bit. Area is smaller, but they are also getting smarter. You are going to see some absolutely ridiculous escapes in the next round as well. Some players have definitely used the tier extra wallet for fast credit card access, bumping out new camos. What you guys can get as well to bump out your credit card in a restaurant, in a bar, or wherever you use it, and many other very high quality and functional products. If you simply go to extra.com and if you use code DESGAMES, you will get 25% off, guys. But but more about that a little bit later because round 3 has already started and we do not have to wait a long time for our first crazy escape in this round already. Prince of 
is very once again something like 50 centimeters away from getting rammed spotted and destroyed but luck was on your side i guess and i think nobody watching right now also noticed prince of who was actually in this bush right over here <laughs> good job mate you are safe being 50 centimeters away from my first victim was followed by many minutes of simply driving around and i did not find anything until i thought what if someone went to the old uh, camping positions or hiding positions and yes we found our first victim in this round kerben vk flashbacks this is the same bush where turnduks was actually found in the first round kerben vk has been eliminated but hopefully 550 gold made you feel a little bit better next up i decided to check if we have any lazy players this round who did not bother moving at all from their spawn and uh, guys we have more than one lazy player actually we have absolute who was caught inside this bush over here and artich out who witnessed all of this from the front row seat once again who basically moved two meters from the spawn but now let's play a little mini game and let me show you how good some players were hiding tear tanks i didn't even know you can go up there yes one gunningham is actually up there so try to spot it yourself from my view so this is basically how i was playing v mode activated no sounds nothing and legit impossible to spot but guys you don't believe me well take a look at that t1 gunningham up here just like that very nice position good find 10 points for that but now let's go back to the enemy base maybe i left some stones unturned over there and i can already feel artichouts uh, bulls increasing simply by looking at the screen and this time i'm going through some of the bushes is artichout able to get away or not no direct hit and artichout has been taken out and our second round is actually over but hopefully 600 gold makes you happier now this time we are not going to reload the battle i am simply going to the corner of the map to give the one gunninghams extra time to hide again in this same battle more areas has been eliminated as you can see and there is one more rule they have to move from their current location at least couple hundred meters time is up ready to go area is smaller but players are hiding better it started me simply driving around tens of bushes hundreds of trees and still absolutely nothing it felt like they vanished off the map uh, until i was able to make my way to the middle by the way guys try to spot someone over here right here do you see no no uh, i can see that easily in the middle of the screen guys did you spot or what if i tell you that i'm in the middle of three t1 gunning hands right now and one guy decided to disguise itself as a truck. Come on, be honest. When did you notice this thing? I almost missed it because my eyes were more focusing towards the middle part of the map over here. But good job, Niekas. Still 600 gold is yours. And there was one player who I did not see. I didn't lie when I said I was in the middle of three players. And guess who it is? Prince of who got away once again. Same cannot be said about uh, the third guy who was over here on the open field. I eat. You have been destroyed. Place number seven, 750 gold is yours. And just like that, we're only one player away from the finals, uh, from the final round four, where top five players are going to hide in the smallest area. There was another lucky player, Gentleman Brook, who I did not spot. But I, Polito, knocked over a tree over here and actually decided to stay in it as well. That was a little bit of a giveaway. At first I thought maybe... Uh, someone fooled me again, but no, I Polito, place number 6, 850 gold to you. And uh, just like that, we made it into the final top 5, is in front of you, Gentleman Brook, Malcolm X, Momix99, Prince of and Shad Stofkesh, uh, sorry, my German is bad, but everyone over here is walking away with at least 1000 gold. So let's make the area even smaller, this is the final after all, and over here, they have to be very very creative or alternatively simply lucky 
time is up, let's go hunting. And I decided to switch it up over here a bit because it is finals after all. While in all the other rounds, I started searching at first around my spawn or around my counting area. Then this time I decided to drive all the way across the map to the other side of it. And uh, well, I can say that Prince of did not like that strategy because I was able to catch Prince of off guard finally. The guy who was able to get away so many times before as the first victim over here but uh, fifth place and 1000 gold is still yours oh it was a good start to catch one player early i like it and it is getting even better because the next victim is already on the screen actually well in a bush right over here yes it is momix 99 who i was able to catch with my first bush checking on this part of the map actually on the uh, water area right momix 99 place number four and also 1000 gold is yours congratulations so now going back to my regular review this is what i saw only guys keep in mind i'm showing you the positions in the post editing of course uh, i did not see anything i was not allowed allowed to use the v-boat or i was not allowed to use anything this was my full view all the time so just making sure i do not miss anything maybe we had some sneaky players um, inside the middle of the map or maybe guys did you catch it did you catch something that was hugging the rock over there yes indeed we have another victim malcolm underscore x good position but your front was showing up a bit and this is what i actually spotted with the corner of my eye up over there you can see yep that right over there <laughs> you should have been a little bit on the lower side but good idea actually to be one with the rock and uh, Malcolm X uh, being top three gets a special treatment how I'm going to take it out a little ram a little love touch let's put it that way anyway congratulations Malcolm X was able to walk away with 1500 gold uh, so now we have only two players left uh, second place gets 2000 and first place gets 3500 gold gentlemen Brook versus Shad who is going to be found first I made sure I do not miss any bushes uh, nothing in the north either so you see me just driving around i'm speeding it up over here because i did a lot of driving before i was able to find the next victim and both of them were very brave actually at the start of the battle parking close to where i was counting down because one guy is right there and the other one is up over there so right now i am in the middle of both players or two final players alive now it comes down to where i am going to go next which bushes am i going to check out next and i'm very close to one player right now am i going to find it am i going to catch the player in my first go in right in front of this push over here you can see like you can see you can't see this is what I'm trying to say, but ladies and gentlemen, this time I made sure I'm going to check every single bush 100% and we found our final victim, Shad. Congratulations, second place and 2000 gold is yours, which makes gentlemen prove our winner of this hide and seek congratulations to you who was sitting right over here in front of me i was driving like basically as far as i'm right now at the start of the battle so gentlemen brook congratulations 3500 gold is yours and as a little tradition well this is our second hide and seek but as a tradition winner can destroy EBR-75 with a tier 1 tank. Well, for some players, this is even better price than winning 3,500 gold, I imagine. It is going to take a long time, though, so while Gentleman Brook is enjoying his price, let me talk to you about our partner in today's video, Exter.com, and this is how I'm actually able to fund those type of fun community events as well. Exter has really high-quality products such as smart wallets, card holders, key trackers, and backpacks for for example and you can feel the quality already from the packaging guys cool wallet like this one i have awesome functionality and easy access to your credit cards uh, you can see and i was able to get a 25 percent discount deal for you as well if you use code desk games so check it out yourself link is in the description extra.com and use code desk games for 25 percent discount
And that is it, ladies and gentlemen, I really hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, consider leaving a thumbs up button, click down, because this video took a long time to make, from organizing to editing and everything. I hope you enjoyed it, I catch you next time with something else, stay awesome!